Hey everybody, it is Sarah with Tech Bargains and today I'm going to be reviewing the Campbell's Kitchen app, which is currently available for free for download. So this app is another cooking app that is really great. Um, there are great recipes in here, um, everything from the novice cook to the pro. And you will feel like a pro because these recipes are relatively simple, not a ton of ingredients, not a lot of prep work. They're just everyday good meals pretty much. Um, so let's just go ahead and dive right in. When you see the homepage of Campbell's Kitchen, you will see a couple things. You'll see a UPC scan tab right up here. You'll see a search box. Uh, they do have a couple number tabs here. These are for different recipes. So you can get uh, like a quick link to them. It's kind of nice. Down at the bottom, you'll see a recipes tab, a quick ideas tab, a recipe box, shopping, and more. So uh, let's go ahead and click on this UPC scan tab right here. This is kind of a nifty little device. What it allows you to do is put this little square on a barcode of one of their products and then it will pull up recipes based on what you have. So uh, some of their products include Campbell's, Swanson, Pace, Prego, Pepperidge Farm, and V8. So that's kind of nice. Uh, be able to use what you have on, on hand. Um, so let's go ahead and go to Quick Ideas so we can take a look at that. Quick Ideas is just uh, similar to lots of apps, lots of cooking apps right now have these ways to make quick uh, dinners with what you have on hand. So they have there's four tabs right up here. There's the Quick and Easy tab, a bit different, uh, so good for you, and Mood. So Quick and Easy allows you to, you know, just do just that. Make a meal that is quick and easy based on prep time. Uh, cook time and who's eating it. And there's even a picky eater section here, which is great for those of you who have kids like me. Um, a bit different is nice too. It'll uh, allow you to, to find a recipe based on taste, simplicity, and the total time uh, to make it. Uh, good for you. Great for those uh, who are looking to make healthier eating choices, especially during the holiday season when that is so hard. It's great to be able to find recipes that will fit into a diet. Uh, based on fat, calories, and the total time again, and then mood, just based on the different uh, types of food out there. That's, that's a great and very useful tab right there. Okay, recipe box. That's a great way to save your favorites. Uh, and if you go ahead and click on any of these or any recipe you're searching for, it'll go ahead and show the recipe for you and some ratings, which is nice. And look how simple. I mean, it, it's such a simple layout right here. It, it shows you exactly uh, the prep time, the baking time, and how much it makes. That's great. And then the steps, step by step. That is totally what I need. Uh, ingredients. I'll go ahead and show you all the ingredients here and how much you're going to need. And then this is where it gets kind of nifty. You can go ahead and create a shopping list uh, out of these ingredients. That's great. So you can go ahead and choose what you need and then add it to your list. Wonderful makes it so much easier than having to write it out. And then you go ahead and add it to your list. Great. Now it also shows your nutrition info, of course, for all those uh, looking to make healthier eating choices. And then down here at the bottom, you're also going to see uh, a dinner boat. Dinner boat's kind of different. What it allows you to do is add recipes to a dinner boat folder, and then you can email them to your family, and then everybody can kind of take a vote and see, uh, you know, the, the recipe that has most votes wins for that night's dinner kind of a thing. It's kind of neat. Um, let's see here. You can also email your shopping list to yourself. Great. Love it because sometimes uh, you're going to pull up the app for whatever reason. You need to look up your email. It's right there. Or you can send that list to your spouse and they can go ahead and pick up what you need on the way home. Great. The other thing I love about the shopping list is the way that they organize it. You can do A to Z right here. Or... You can do it by recipe, which is really useful because sometimes you're at the grocery store and you're like, what, what am I buying this for again? Oh yeah, it's right here. It's, it's this recipe that I need this for. Great. So overall, we really like this app. Um, we gave it a four out of five, simply based on the fact that occasionally the app does crash. Uh, that's too bad, but it is a free app. Um, that's basically one of our only complaints. Otherwise, it, it has great pictures. Um, really easy to read, really easy format to read, easy to navigate. And so we really, really uh, appreciated that. So uh, happy cooking to you all. If you like this review and you'd like to see others like it, 
please go to our YouTube channel and subscribe at www.youtube.com forward slash user forward slash tech bargains. Thank you.